Greetings, fam. I know y'all didn't expect me to be back this quick, but um, me and my husband um, have been doing the smoothie thing for like the whole week, like I was telling y'all last night. And so I had a craving today, though, because we got back on with the smoothies. This morning, I tried beets. So I did beet tops and the beets, um, pineapples. Oh, shoot. Oh, pears and some ginger. Because I know I was doing bad food combinations, so I went ahead and put the ginger in there to help me digest it. It was so good. Um, I never tasted beets before, especially not raw beets. Um, but it was really good. It had, it did taste like kind of earthy, but once I got used to the taste, you know, because I didn't know what to expect, but once I got used to the taste, it was really good. Then um, I kind of cheated a little bit for lunch, so I had strawberries pears oh that's sad I can't remember but anyway it was really good it was kind of a cheat because it didn't have any greens or anything in it so anyway for dinner I thought I would surprise my husband by doing some raw spaghetti so I did um I used some zucchini um for the noodles of course on my spiralizer um but for the for the sauce I did dried tomatoes, sun-dried tomatoes, um, regular tomatoes, which shout out to Cupid Valentino because he showed me how to get the meat off of the tomato without slicing it and then squeezing all the little guts out and all that stuff. It saved me so much time, so thank you. Um, so I used that. I used red uh, bell pepper, purple or red onion, whichever you call it, um, fresh basil, um, the Italian seasoning, um, and a little bit of salt, just a little bit, and I diced up some mushrooms, portobello, I'm a mushroom addict. Um, so I blended up the sun-dried tomatoes and the regular tomatoes together, my vitamins, because my, um, food processor broke. What's my time like? Okay, my food processor broke. So I put that in my vitamins, and then I used, then I did the onions, bell pepper, onions, bell pepper, and a little bit more sun-dried tomato, and the garlic. That's all I forgot. And the garlic, um, I put that in there together and, you know, use the little um, stick thing. I forgot what they call it, but the little stick thing to push it down. So I did that and then I put it all together. Oh, and I chopped up the basil separately and I did put it all together. Then I chopped up the um, mushrooms after everything was all mixed up in a bowl. I chopped up the mushrooms, you know, kind of small and put them in there. So did that and then I found this dressing it is vegan i doubt it's raw but it's vegan um and it's in the refrigerator section of produce so you know we're getting there but it's a ginger dressing so we're gonna make salad um a real simple salad to go with it um i guess technically the whole meal is a salad but that's fine so um i'm gonna post some pictures i have to figure out how to post the pictures at the end um because i don't really edit videos but i guess i'm gonna learn today just because i love y'all so much so, um, I hope y'all enjoy it. I tasted it. It's so good. I can't wait to eat it because I'm sick of sweet stuff. I don't, I haven't figured out how people do the smoothies all the time that are sweet. Oh, but the other day I had a craving for, um, cucumbers and vinegar, which I love. But remember we weren't supposed to be doing, um, solid foods at that time. So what I did, I put everything that I put in my cucumbers. And I put it in a blender and blend it down. Oh, so good. Anyway, so I'm going to figure out how to put the pictures. They might be inside the video or they might be at the end. But anyway, just work with me. Y'all know I'm trying. So I'll talk to y'all later. I hope you enjoy. Molara, moloba. Molara, moloba. Yami pale. Molara.
Bye. 